Julian Gringas was born as the youngest boy to a middle-class family in 1911. The family was 11 strong, including five boys and four girls. The Gringasses lived in a town called Kielce, located in Poland. His father was a photographer, and the family had a small photographer photography studio in their home. His family was not super religious. His mom was the most religious, and she would make sure the family celebrated Shabbat, but Julian was not opposed to the occasional ham sandwich. Julian attended an elementary school, which he referred to as a gymnasium. As he became older, he went to study in a school at Warsaw. He stayed for a few years, but was arrested for affiliations with local communist groups. He remained in prison for two months, but was soon after acquitted. Julian had a girlfriend by the name of Fella. He often referred to her as his wife, but they were never officially married. Fella belonged to a family of tailors. Her family was far more religious than Julian's, but they were nowhere near orthodox. They met when Fella was 17 and Julian was 23. Julian was best friends with Fella's brother, Motsebam. They went to school together. At this point, everyone knew what was happening in Germany, but no one anticipated it traveling farther east or escalating into a war. Julian had since returned to his hometown. In early September, the town woke up to a bombing of their city. Everyone ran and began to flee on foot. Julian began fleeing with a small bag on his bicycle, along with Fella and two of her siblings. Farther along towards the USSR, the group split to where it was just Julian and Fella. Once they were a safe distance from the anarchy, Julian began to look for work, but since he never finished his schooling, he struggled. He eventually began building roads and helping with odd, odd jobs. In the early 1940s, the pair split up so Fella could go visit her sister, who was teaching farther north, and Julian went to Luo to finish his schooling alongside Motze, Fella's brother and Julian's longtime friend. Julian met up briefly with his parents in a town called Kovel. He begged his parents not to return to Kelsey, but they went against his wishes and brought Julian's two youngest sisters along with them. Julian lost contact with his parents in 1942. Not long after, Kelsey was liquidated to Birkenau. Julian did not find out until long after due to the lack of information making it past the Russian borders. Julian finished school and managed to get a job at a local Russian vodka factory. Fella and Julian were reunited after their few months apart. Julian soon got a job transfer to Tarnopol. When the war broke out and the Germans were headed their way, Fella, Julian, and a few work colleagues fled east towards Kiev. They found a train station and went to Tashkent. Julian had continuous job relocations until the end of the war. After the war, he and Fella took a train back to Poland. They decided on Warsaw after an old friend had asked them to come. They arrived two months before the Kelsey program. At the end of the war, when Julian began finding information, he learned that along with most of Fella's family, his parents and two younger sisters died at Birkenau. Another sister of his was killed during the Kelsey Kiel pogrom. She and her two children were shot, and her husband was tied to the back of a truck and dragged across town. Julian and Fella had two children and continued to live in Warsaw until Fella's death in, in the 1980s.